In a previous video we already make get started screen, home screen and a search screen. So now we can continue to create detail photo screen. We'll navigate into detail photo screen when we tap on our image, so we need to set a navigation function in our photo both in home screen and search screen. When navigating we also bring the photo detail data. Now we create our detail photo screen. And register it in our route generator. We will use same format as in the previous screen. We will have two widget, screen and layout, in our detail photo screen. For the app we will use this widget app bar, it's just a simple app bar with text, and two button for navigating back and for sharing the photo. Now we will prepare our state management or our block or qubit. Our state will only have two parameter for share status and download status, and we run build runner to generate the rest of our state. After that we will register our block or qubit in the root of our detail photo screen. For our photo data we will get it from modal route with help from build context, the data passed when we navigating via argument parameter. For the scaffold body, we will have two widget, so we use column as our parent widget. The first one is the photo itself. For the photo we will show the original image. But when it's loading we will have the portrait first, because the portrait one is already loaded in memory in previous page. We will use the rest of our screen for our second widget. The second widget is detail photo and action widget. In detail photo we will have title, descriptions if there is, and the colors from the photo. For the color of the photo we need to pass it from a string to our color class, and we will use extension function on a string class. With this to color function, we will have a color class from a plain text or string.
And the last one, we will have two button for main function in this screen, an edit and download button. And that's it. Thanks for watching.